Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Sid Meier's Civilization V, Brave New World as the Arabian Empire. And I thought about it a little bit. Okay, now there is merit to popping the Great Artist right now, and that is specifically to um, get the tourism right away. However, you know, I am getting the Louvre up soon. Now, having the Louvre is, you know, if I were to pop it now, I would be going into the industrial era, which means I would not be able to use that great artist for a theming bonus in Ufuzi. I would have to use it in, like, the Louvre. The Louvre, however, I need to have two great works of art and two great work or two artifacts, and none of them can be from the same era, and none of them can be from the same civilization. It's kind of hard to set up. Now, if I were to pop the Great Artist now, that would mean I wouldn't get Ufuzi for a while, and I'd probably have to trade some artifacts, some art or artifacts around anyway, because I don't know what artifacts I'll get. I might find some Arabian artifacts here, and that might be easier to work with. So it's actually, I'm going to hang on to it for five turns for Ufuzi, specifically, because I want that theming bonus first. Uh, meanwhile, let's go ahead and hook up a windmill. And new proposal, okay. Um, each world wonder provides plus three culture to its city. That's great, but other cultures will then get culture. Uh, arts funding, I like the sound of that. Now, who would actually be upset by that? Nobody. Okay, arts funding. We will do arts funding. Because with arts funding, yay. Uh, that was barely passed. And, wow, everybody hated that idea. <laughs> well, tough. There's nothing you can do. Okay, uh, we have... A worker who is going to go. Is this not hooked up? Huh, go hook up that wheat. Oh, that's long overdue. Yeah, we're working a lot of unimproved tiles here. So I think what I'm actually going to do is once these workers become available, get them down here and, like, look, the sheep aren't even hooked up. What am I doing with this city? My gosh. Uh, can I actually go, like, production focus on that? Default focus? Yeah, let's just stick with default. What am I doing with this city? Okay, Camel Archer, go ahead and take a shot. That doesn't take long. Wow. Alrighty, then. Uh, good job, everyone. Good job. They went down fast. Good God. Uh, I need five more turns for a new social policy, which will be great. Uh, my settler is somewhere around here now. Yeah. No, go back. Go back. Go back. You want a deal? Let's. Will you give me eight coal per turn for it? Great. I love the money. Money makes the world go round. Now, arts funding, that's going to be interesting. I'm going to have to make sure I get my production ramped up everywhere, too. Because I'm going to need those buildings to support that. And, oh, I'm actually getting fairly close to a golden age, too. That will be fun. Uh, meanwhile, why don't you go ahead and make your way back into the city, because I don't need you out there. Where is my settler? Um, I could go on the coast. I actually don't have any coastal cities. And that would give me fish and not much else. Do I want the coastal city? 
probably couldn't hurt. And it would give me a little bit more space here. Yeah, we'll go to the coast. Camel Archer, um... You go ahead and just kind of make your way back here. Oh, I thought I already lost you long ago. They want a natural wonder. Um... I may have to explore. <laughs> I've already revealed as much of the map as I think I could. Uh, will you give me eight gold per turn for it? Fantastic. Okay, I should do a check and make sure I've got open borders everywhere, too. Now, Japan hates my guts so much they will not give me open borders for anything. That is crazy. And I can't blame them. I took Kyoto. I took their capital and... Kicked them out. I stole the Great Wall from them. Wow. That's Japan for ya. They had one musketman just murder most of a platoon by himself. That's the way it goes with Japan. Ah, my camel archer. Uh, let's go and might as well get a promotion out of the deal. I get onto land. Okay, we'll build a farm there. And I guess, oh, it's already been cleared up. Fine. Uh, a pagoda's been purchased in Baghdad. And we shouldn't have many more places that need pagodas. Uh, marble. Really? Venice beat me on faith. That's interesting. Venice is producing more faith than me. Huh. Actually, what I should do is I should take this Inquisitor or a missionary. I should take a missionary and send it over to, uh, to this city. Once it gets a little bit of my faith, send an Inquisitor. Or can I just use an Inquisitor once it gets infected with Buddhism? I'm not sure how Inquisitors work. Uh, let's get you back onto land. I'm not sure how Inquisitors work, but I would like to set it up where I can just pop it over into uh, my faith for just a little bit, long enough to actually um, make those purchases, you know, purchase my buildings for the tourism. Uh, you're no longer friends, which kind of sucks. Uh, you gave me coal, which kind of rocks. You go ahead and just sort of make your way back. And how close is this stupid settler? My gosh. Taking so long to get over there. <laughs> But in the end, I think it's going to be worth it. Because with that, we'll be able to trade with Venice. And it'll be fantastic. And we'll have uh, King Solomon's Mines, too. Hey, great musician. And a Golden Age. Okay, so let's go ahead and start hooking up some of these tiles because, holy crap, how are we working this many unimproved tiles? I will start over here. And over here. Get some farms hooked up. You can go into alert mode. 
you don't have a place that you can actually put that. Um, you're building a bank. And there'll be a monument after that. You don't need a bank too terribly much. Let me actually prioritize those. Or wait, what's your production? 22? Let's prioritize the workshop. I don't know why that wasn't at the top. Okay, uh, can I just go ahead and purchase an amphitheater? And then an opera house. Wow, that was expensive, but next turn I'll be able to use him. Okay, we got a cathedral in Kyoto. We got you. Golden Age. And they want me to demand tribute. Well, that's not going to happen. And hey, next turn I'll get a policy too. This will be a great turn. Of course, I say that. <laughs> I say that with the full expectation that something's going to blow up in my face. Like somebody's going to build build the Louvre or something equally horrifying. Those who cannot remember the past are condemned to repeat it. If you pick up a starving dog and make him prosperous, he will not bite you. This Oop, oh well. Okay, new social policy. Yes, extra culture for world wonders. And I'm already in a golden age, but I can extend it this way, I think. So how much am I doing now? 199. Yeah, an extra 29 culture. That's not bad. 10 more turns, and I'll bump up my modifier. And... Wow. I'll be able to double my theming bonuses and start purchasing things. So now you can go ahead and just create a great work, which is fine. Um, you can go ahead and just make that. Fantastic. Uh, and let's make sure we get that in New Fuzi. Industrial era, yeah. We'll put that in there. So, uh, I will use that one turn to finish the windmill. Can I not build the Louvre? Has the Louvre already been constructed somewhere? Oh. Well, that sucks. I wonder who built the Louvre. sucks okay um in that case there's bound to be a city that i don't really need to be building things in right now um let's put together some archaeologists all righty unit needs orders you go ahead and rest and next oh shoot no 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 you i want you to move to probably the danes uh if you have differing ideologies only okay so why don't you make your way up here Okay, uh, I've got more stuff from city-states, okay, oh, I've got that there, that's interesting. I've got a lot of antiquity sites in my own borders. Oh, gosh, look at all of them!
That is something. So we're definitely going to, because we've got a lot of potential places to work, put uh, artifacts, especially with all those cathedrals. So I'm definitely going to be getting as many of those as I can. Now, how long until I produce my next uh, great artist? I need two more. I'm actually... I can't believe somebody else built the Louvre already. Uh, how am I doing on great artists? Uh, it's going to be a while. Okay, so over here we're going to build... Uh, might as well make a windmill. Might as well make a windmill. And you can make a farm. You can go over here and make a farm. You can make your way over here. Wow, riflemen. Um, I may have to start working on my military at some point. Uh, you sit tight. On the plus side, we've got a lot of Golden Age going on. For the next 22 turns, we're in a Golden Age. Now, if I could just get a, um... How about cotton? And yeah, gold is fine. Was she offering me five gold for turn that she doesn't even have? Hmm. Maybe I should have just taken that to bankrupt her. Then another deal with give her the uh, the citrus for the cotton. Oh well. Mistakes were made, and Japan and the Danes are still at war. My gosh. How long has this war been going on? I don't even know. And overall, I don't think it's that important. Okay, Harold Bluetooth is constructing Big Ben, alright. Um, cathedral has been purchased. And we're doing not a lot of damage to the riflemen. Uh, let's just end our turn like that. Next turn. Hopefully we can get our public schools up pretty soon. Scientific theory. If we focus on that, we can get a lot of um, a nice science boost. Maybe pull ourselves ahead in science? Because we're definitely not doing great with science right now. I mean, my gosh, we got beaten to the Louvre. I wanted that Louvre. I think Venice might be the one that has it, though. I don't know. They're the only ones who seem to be playing culturally. So they probably have the Louvre. And it might get to the point where I might have to go to war with them. Take their capital just to stop their cultural growth. It's tough to say. I mean, I'm not against that. I can probably very easily become influential against everyone except Venice without even trying. Like just keeping this up, I can very easily become influential. Venice, however, if I have to, it might reach the point where it would be just easier to go to war with them and just kill them entirely. 
go ahead and found a city. Uh, ooh. That's not good. Why don't we... Um... You know, it would be great if I could just snag the encampment now, but... Let's go ahead and move back one. Take a pot shot. And then move back again. There we go. Uh, production. You... can build me... Uh, start with a monument. Because I would like to get that ivory. In fact, I think I'm going to buy that ivory. Yeah, now I've got ivory. Uh, well, not yet. I need to send a worker over there. So actually, I'm just going to take you, interrupt what you're doing, and have you begin that long, slow walk. I should have sent, uh, uh oh. I should have sent a worker up there sooner. Oh my gosh, those are riflemen. Um, how am I going to do this? Where are all of my camel archers? Why is my military technology so crap? Okay, let's send virtually all of our guys up there. There we go. I believe we can. Prague wants a trade route. Venice is now the uh, their ally. Okay. Oh, I should actually just go ahead and purchase a trade route here. Buy a trade route. And you know what? Let's go ahead and also buy something that'll boost my growth. Aqueduct? Aqueduct. For the growth. And that'll probably do it. Could buy a granary. Uh, yeah, because I want this city to grow fairly quickly. Camel Archer, okay. Hey, we killed one. And got a load of culture from it, too. That's fine with me. Oh, Attila's about to lose a, uh, a caravan there. Poor you. <sighs> and the eternal war between the Danes and the Japanese continues. The Danes might actually take to Tokyo at some point. I mean, that is looking very likely. Okay, you can go on a trade route to... Attila's court would actually give me the most. But I need... Well, no, Venice would. Venice would give me a lot of gold and a lot of science. Yes. And as I improve that city, as it gets better... Um, As that city improves, it should be less of an issue. I should be getting more and more gold from that. But right now, I like need to uh, hook up that ivory is something I have to do. I'll have to hook up those fish at some point. I've just got so much I need to do over here. And I don't think I need this many troops nearby, but I'm going to keep them. You can just kind of sit tight. You're protected by the river. Why don't you step back one? Next turn. Uh, actually, I just noticed the clock. Um, I think what I'm going to need to do is get ready to go ahead and put a cut in this video. 
Uh, probably send that scout up actually to my border so I can get embarkation uh, upgraded if I haven't already. I don't remember if I do, but I'll see you next time, folks. Bye-bye.